Okay, we're gonna show you how to make the basic flower building shape. You need to work with a completely square piece of paper to start. So fold it on a diagonal to make a square and cut off the remainder, which you can save to make your smaller flowers. Don't get rid of that. These are vintage book pages that we're using from books that were gonna be thrown away. So you have square, now you have your triangle. You're gonna fold it into a triangle again nice and neatly and then you're going to fold back each corner to make a smaller triangle but you're going to fold it back on each side Perfect. And then you're going to hold it along the seam so the open edges are on top hold it flat yep and you're going to cut a petal shape you can sketch this out you can sketch this out if you need or you can just freehand cut the petal shape and you can vary the size of your flower by, and again, ideally you don't want to do this. You don't want to be cutting a million different little petals. You want to try to use the crotch of the scissors to have a seamless. There you go. There you have your base flower. Now we're going to go ahead and make a smaller flower with a different petal shape to put in and put on top of it. So again, fold your base triangle. Cut off your remainder. wind blowing. Okay. I'm going to fold another triangle. And you're going to fold back each side. Fold back the other side. Okay. I'm going to have the open edge there. I'm going to cut maybe a steeper petal on this one. Perfect over tweaking there. You're going to open it up. Okay, so then you're going to take your petals. We actually, we have one we cut previously. And you're going to stack them up, usually kind of alternating which direction the words face. And then you're going to use a little... Oh, we forgot to bring them out. A little pin. To, that you push through. It's called a brad to hold the center. So, a little bit of poor planning on our part without our brad. But that you get the basic idea. And you can use any kind of paper, any kind of pattern, all different sizes, and layer up your flowers.